Hi folks, Tim Harrigan from High End Cheap Tech, and I'm just reaching in here. We got this uh, package today at about 7.30 this morning, so the second section of this you'll see was already filmed, uh, unfortunately twice. That will be explained in the video, uh, let's put it mildly. The uh, Alcatel here does not like Samsung cards, so it now has silicon power 128. And the camera we filmed, yeah, facing down, showing you stuff, taking it apart. Uh, it's got the Samsung Evo in it. I tried two different Evo cards in it. The one on my tablet. No worky. So let's get to the video right now, which we're filming on the world's greatest phone, the Axon M. No more bang for the buck. Under 200 bucks. Hell, under 250, under 275. That's the best damn budget, true budget. Um, in the world. M microphone's fantastic. Nothing's pinned on me like I had earlier with the new mobile. So, let's get to that right after the intro. All right, folks, so here we go. Uh, I uh, have to reshoot this section because of the Alcatel being a nitpicky bastard of a phone. Okay, so that's the package it all came in. You're gonna have to trust me on that. Somewhere over here was there. And on the other side was a little green Samsung Evo which we are now writing this video file to on the uh, uh, new mobile G3. Yeah, the new mobile kind of got screwed in the whole deal because the Alcatel wants nothing to do with Samsung Evo cards. So this, this card's not supported, you can't format it. I, I plugged it into the PC, it works fine. I, Obviously, it's plugged into here. So, now, I have a grand total of uh, 64 gig, or 128 on this phone, and 160, because this one got the 128 gig silicon power, which I know it's an off-brand. But it's not that off a of brand, folks. It's the piece, my PC's hard drive or SSD is a silicon power. I'm looking at getting a bigger silicon power. They make good stuff. Simple as that. So, I have put that in there. And so let's check it out. <laughs> Uh, storage and I formatted this internal storage they call it smart ranger mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, we've used a 5.4 gig of 128 gig yeah okay so uh, wow guess who got Guess who won this battle? The Alcatel. Hmm. I guess me saying it wasn't my favorite phone pissed it off. But point of fact is do not buy a Samsung Evo card if you have an Alcatel. It'll, I mean, I pulled the one on my tablet. It's a generation back. <laughs> This doesn't support Samsung cards. 
Huh? Why? Hello. Why? No one knows. And it's definitely a genuine Samsung. I looked at it six ways from Sunday, so. Eh. Oh, yeah. It's gloating now, isn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah, 19.49 units of 160 gig. Yeah, so the Al Alcatel needs to have all low storage. All right. So for now, that's about all I have. I stuffed it in. I moved it. Had I had any brains, I would have taken the silicon power and uh, put it over into the you know using the adapter any adapter I had sitting around and transferred the files and then brought them all back because I lost a few apps on this particular phone the one we're filming on you know my favorite phone the new mobile G3 of the three I have. Well, actually, the Axon M is my favorite. And it's the one I'm testing. But still, and it has a 128 in it from Silicon Power. It's sitting right over here, by the way. And there it sits. You know. Super cool. Sitting in tent mode. Makes it super easy to set it up and get it to uh, do what you want it to. <clears throat> That's about all I have for today. Do not buy a Samsung Evo if you have an Alcatel phone. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not sure there's anything wrong with them. It works super good. In the phone we're looking at, go figure. Alcatel, you don't like the folks that were Samsung or something, I don't know. All right, folks, so the bottom line here is, if you own an Alcatel 7, do not buy a Samsung Evo card like that. Mm -hmm. Just don't do it. Trust me, it, it doesn't like them. I tried two different ones in it, the one on my tablet, and yeah, I've already gone over that. So, if you found this the least bit informative and helpful, make sure you check out the uh, comments section and leave something. And you might want to consider leaving a thumbs up and definitely hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. Beyond that, thanks for watching.